Hey now, Mike Shaman here, and today I'm just going to walk you through a quick tutorial on gravity forms and how to remove the labels inside of the gravity forms. So, this is the label that we're talking about, these labels right here. So, we don't want this form to have a, a, a label. We want it to look nice and clean. And um, to do this, for one, you need to have gravity forms. If you have contact form 7, this will not work. So, gravity forms only. Go in the back of the gravity forms. And this is my form, just an email. And you can see under appearance, there's a placeholder which shows up here. And then there's nothing else here. So, what we want to do is I actually wrote a blog post on this. And you can go over to my blog post and you can get the label for what it is. Okay, copy it. Now, in the back end of your website, you want to go to appearance and you want to go to editor. Okay, and that'll take you to. Uh, Probably your style is CSS. A couple things you want to make sure you're on your child theme. Okay, you're on your child theme, and that you're in functions PHP. Okay, so once you navigate there, just some space, add the label, update the file, and now when you go back to your gravity forms should be able to refresh your page all right go to the appearance tab and then you'll see this field label visibility visibility just go hidden update your form all right and refresh your page all right and it's gone there it is now, one thing about this too. So, if you didn't make this change on your on your child theme and you made it on your parent theme, and it gets erased during an update, just I just want to show you what happens if you erase it during an update, and you go back to your forms. So right now it has it. Okay, and I'm just going to go to refresh. Now it doesn't have it, and your your field is hidden until you put it back. So you need so if this uh, label gets del deleted, and you have something hidden, you're not going to be able to change it back until it's back in the code. So once you do that, okay, it's back there, and you can change it. So. Um, that's the easy way on how to remove labels from gravity forms. Go ahead, check out my blog post for the code there. Have a good one.